High temperatures today in the low 50s, which makes it relative rarefied air for this month. Uh, take a look at this month visually, how many days below average and just a handful above average. So right now running at 4.4 below average in Portland. And a lot of these are in the top five, if we close out this way, for coldest Novembers. We had a cold November last November as well. It's just been a trend we've been into lately. Here's a radar picture. We've got uh, Storm 1, Storm 2. They will combine together out toward Chicago later on tonight and move in as a continental storm, meaning coming in from the land, not the ocean. And so typically when that happens, and this will be the case here, we get mixed precipitation. It's hard for us to get a clean continental storm, the exception being an Alberta cliff but uh, otherwise they're usually mixed up like this. So our by our forecast, the rest of tonight is clear and not overly cold. Temperatures right around freezing by early tomorrow morning. First half of the day, again, no problems. In fact, we might see some sun over down east and northern Maine to start the day. We start to cloud up, though, by the middle of the day. And then here comes what is initially largely rain. Whoa, I skipped ahead. Initially largely rain here on Wednesday afternoon into Wednesday night. Some of us wait until right after sunset to get into it. Sleet in the mountains changing to snow. Notice the snow line though starts moving slowly towards the coastline overnight into Thursday. And now Thursday morning it's snowing over down east. It's snowing a little bit over the mid coast and ends as some flakes over southern coastal Maine before we get it out of here Thursday later in the day. So the first half of Thanksgiving will feature some snow. We talked yesterday about the European model versus the GFS, whether or not there'd be any snow over down east Maine. We leaned towards the Euro and that ended up, it seems to be correct because the GFS has now jumped on board with it. So one to three inches, including the coastline here, three to six. Uh, and I had put Bangor in that three to six, even though it appears as though they're on the line, I'd put them on three to six. And then six plus inches into the mountains where they will be happy to see that. It's been a nice start for the base. Next storm system comes in Monday into Tuesday. That looks pretty nasty as well. Could last through quite a bit of the day on Tuesday. So there you have it. It's it's not terrible in that a lot of it is later on Wednesday. So if you get out first half of the day, no problems there. It's chilly Friday, Saturday and Sunday. We discuss whether or not people still like wait outside malls anymore. I don't think they do, but if they do, oh, it's some people be chilly. do. Some people, uh, you know, yeah, because I think some of the stores just ramp up those. You know, right. first people the through the door. The sales got to be better and, and better. Get a fifty inch for forty bucks yeah. or something. Right, you know, right, people right, will right. line up. Yeah.